Hello everybody, welcome back to our channel. Today we go on the N1 through the Higuno Tunnel towards the Hex River Valley. Our destination is Simons Kloof Mountain Retreat. We drive past Worcester and we turn off towards the Koo Valley. This is a beautiful part of our country. From the Durans you turn right onto the large river turn off and then you will be driving a good gravel road until you reach Simons Kloof. Simons Kloof is surrounded by mountains and it's a scenic road to drive up to the gate. On the website they promise you the three R's, relaxing, resting and recharging and that is definitely what you will get. There are eight off the grid private campsites. The campsites all have grass and are surrounded by trees. You will definitely need the trees and the shade in summertime. The campsites are beautiful and you can truly just relax, rest and recharge your batteries here. The campsite is pet friendly and Sava just loved running after her red ball again. You might also get visits from the local animals. Most of the campsites have their own water point and it is absolutely lovely spring water. There is no cell phone reception and there's also no electricity. Again, you can play with your solar panels. You can buy firewood from the reception and seeing that it's an eco-friendly campsite, it comes in a reusable container. The bry is on the ground and I just love a bry like that. We sat until late next to the fire. The ablutions look like the picture out of a fairy tale book. All the toilets are a short walk away from the campsite. The toilets are all eco friendly toilets. This toilet definitely have a view second to none. A handful of sawdust after you've used the toilet keeps the flies away and also takes the smell away. On the opposite side of the stream, there's an open air shower with a gas heater. In the wild plum forest, there's another open air eco friendly toilet. If you walk further down the forest, you will eventually get to an open air shower. It is so beautiful. I almost expected to see fairies and elves running around in the forest. This shower has a donkey and that will give you the hot water for the shower. There is quite a few activities that you can do. We decided to take a nice walk up the mountain and to go look at the rock pools. Bird watchers will just love it here. They identified 70 bird species 
in this area there's also beautiful little flowers that you can see along the way this is truly a place where you can relax enjoy nature and just get away from your normal daily hustle and bustle We drove back home via the Ku Valley and Montiki and we stopped at Opa Bat Sevago. Opa Bat store is a store that's been in the family for more than three generations. It's a typical old farm store where you can buy almost everything. The family was also very much involved in establishing the local school and the local church. The drive home was just as beautiful through the KC, the Ku Valley and eventually through Montiki. We will definitely be back again. Thank you for watching our video. If you've liked it, please hit like and subscribe and please feel free to comment. Until next time, happy camping.